Laurel County Sheriff John Root posting a video on Facebook that's getting a lot of attention. It was in response to the UK men's basketball team who kneeled before their game over the weekend. Here is a look. We're kind of discussing the outrage last night of the University of Kentucky Wildcats uh, that uh, disrespected our American flag and our national anthem. And this is what I think about the program, Coach, until you can get these guys under control and lead by example. Here's my shirt. I've got another one going right in behind it. The sheriff and his friend, County Jailer Jamie Mosley, continued their video to show support for another blue team, law enforcement. After Saturday night's game, UK's players said this action was a message toward the ongoing issues that are taking place in the nation. In the post-game news conference, Coach John Calipari said this. I think, again, it, it, it's something that speaks for itself and these kids are good kids and, you know, they, they care about this country and all the other stuff. And, you know, they're trying to figure out life and making statements that they think they have to make. And I want to listen to what they're saying and then I'll support them if they want me to be there. If they said we're good by ourselves, I probably wouldn't have been out there. UK forward Keon Brooks said, quote, we just came together as leaders of the team and decided this is something we want to do to take a stand to what we're seeing in the world today. Coach was with us. It's great to have the man in charge backing you with everything you do, end quote. And Michael Burke has more now on this issue with Sheriff Root and Jailer Mosley in Laurel County. We're told Sheriff John Root will not be commenting on the t-shirt burning video he posted to social media yesterday, but Jamie Mosley, the county jailer who also appeared in that video, has released a statement on what took place. Sheriff John Root certainly didn't hide his disdain over what he saw over the weekend when several Kentucky basketball players took a knee during the national anthem. So in response, he burned an old Final Four t-shirt. Certainly a lot of people didn't agree with what he did, but it's certainly his right, just as it is the player's right to take a knee. But during a time when so many are in need, burning an article of clothing did seem a little tone deaf, so they've turned it into a clothing drive. Drop off an article of clothing you're no longer using here at the Laurel County Jail, and you'll receive a t-shirt in return. The clothing bags, many of them already filled already, will be taken to the Laurel County Homeless Shelter. Mosley told me over the phone that while not everyone obviously agreed with what they did, at least something positive was able to come from it as they're able to help those in need. In Laurel County, Michael Burke, LEX 18.